What did you do today? I do hand job full day. What's your hobby? Do you like hand job? I think he meant manual labor, lost in translation. Hi guys, St. Spence here again. Sorry I wasn't able to do another video sooner. It's because Ego has taken over my life. Like, literally taken over it. I have no time. <laughs> you send your naked photo and WhatsApp no. Astaraga. Bigo, bigo, bigo. Um, it's just such an interesting app. I feel like I'm discovering the world through my phone and in a more personal way because you get to ask questions, get to connect to people that you probably wouldn't normally connect with and you get to discover different places. You can ask them, can you show me how it looks like outside? You get to know the weather there. We know about Australia and the bushfires, but we don't know what the people there actually feel or go through. And I met someone, Big Ando, Big Crazy Chef, or Crazy Chef, whatever your name is now. Not everyone knows that when they go outside, it's smoky even they, if they're far from the bushfires. And not everyone knows how many times he had to go and pick up his family to make sure that they're safe. I didn't know that that's what other people are going through. And they experience drought. They have to save a lot of water and it makes you kind of appreciate what you have where you are. I get to see um, scorpions, how you take care of scorpions. I get sent pictures. And I think that's really really interesting for me and you get to see a lot of different types of people and I'm I'm not even kidding like there are a lot of crazy people out there and you would only realize that more on we go do me a favor I'm tired of seeing your picture please stop stop what then don't look at it and then you get to discover different cultures um, from different countries you get to discover a lot of different talents I find it particularly interesting listening to someone speaking in a different language like if I watch um, someone who's French talking in French I find it very interesting even if I do not understand what they're talking about and um, there is this Russian girl who sings very well and plays the guitar and even if she sings in Russian I still really enjoy it so you get to discover a lot of different kinds of people wherever they are in the world and connect with them and I think I'm naturally curious in nature anyway so kind of always wonder oh, what do other people do in that country like people who do the same job as me what's the difference if I work there what do they encounter or even people who do other jobs you know what is the difference there's a lot of things that is different and it's just very very interesting for me and that's why even though a lot of people think I'm crazy for reading all my fan mail today I can visit market just I miss you what are you gonna buy now you and your love I still do I still read my fan mail I don't get paid extra for reading my fan mail but um, I feel kind of bad if I don't read them because I feel like someone is trying to tell me something and I'm just gonna ignore it and I kind of feel like it's rude if I ignore it and not only that I feel like I'm missing out on something if I don't read it because there's a lot of interesting people out there and there's a lot of things that we can learn from different people out there and the only reason why we don't get to do that is because we don't have that connection we don't have that way to communicate with each other and they're right here trying to communicate with me and the least I could do is read their message just read it so I do take my time it takes me hours it used to just take me one hour and now it's gone up to two hours I time it now because I just have to tell myself that's enough you can't do any more. Otherwise, I'll be on my phone all day. No, I'm gonna reply to everyone, even if they don't give me gifts. No, oh my gosh, you won't understand about gifting if you're not on, if you don't have the app. Four hundred dollar gift. Follow and message me. I'll pay any way you like now. Four hundred dollars. My follow is not for sale. Sorry. And I wanna be fair to everyone. I want to treat everyone the same way, whether 
they give me or not are a higher level on the app or not because that's just the way I am you know I, I don't feel like I have to change myself just so I can survive better or do better and I know it's not very productive on my part but it makes me feel good inside if I do it my way you know I refuse to let money run my life I refuse to let money be the main thing that that makes the world go round or be my main motivation for everything I do because that just makes me feel so sad <laughs> you just accept that that's the way things are no I refuse to accept that no so I'm not gonna do things because you're gonna pay me no I'm not gonna reply to you because you're gonna pay me you hello do you do private calls thank you hello do you do video calls for diamonds thank you hi no I don't do private sorry and I don't have a price even with diamonds I'm priceless I'm gonna make my own rules if you're nice to me then okay I'm gonna reply to you if you talk to me the right way, I'm gonna reply to you. But don't bribe me or like, don't try to buy me. I have no regrets in, in reading messages, even though I get a lot of <sighs> annoying messages. Hello. Hi. Hi, babe. I want to lick your bob and pussy. Who is Bob? I wish I was married to you. Oh, I don't want to get married anymore. Do you want to see my cup? No. And of course, there's the predators. Oh my gosh. You get people who would trick you into following them and then send you dick pics. Does this ever work, ever? When you send someone a dick pic, do you ever get the girl? I'm just really curious. Why does everyone do it? And no, I did not play that video. Oh my gosh. And it is. It's like, I feel like I've been harassed, you know? Why are you exploiting me? Doesn't mean I'm in here. You can just exploit me like that. What you buying? Clothes, shoes. Send me hot pick there. I want to see your hot pick. I don't do hot picks. Why, my friend? Just me see your hot pick. Okay, me nightwear pick. No. How much for a private? I don't do private and I'm not for sale, sorry. And people who try to buy you. What is that? And then you get a lot of these sugar daddies looking for sugar babies and offering money, weekly allowance. I know I keep messages private, but heartfelt ones, you know, ones that you know actually cares. But some of these messages, I don't think they care. I think they message that to everyone and I think they deserve to be exposed for harassing us. And of course, countless, countless indecent proposals. <laughs> I'll give you... 1,000 per week to be my sugar baby oh my gosh and I'm like I'm not for sale and then it seems like he thought that the price is not right and then he even bargained like 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 I'm in Divisoria or or like a market you know like oh you don't like the price I'll up it it's like 1,500 per week I was like, no! Have you ever had sex? I have two kids. Okay, good. I want a sex with you. Not gonna happen. It is absolutely mad. But I want to share it with you. Because if you're gonna be a new Bigo user, don't let it put you off using Bigo because it's still a great app amidst all the craziness. I hope you like this video. Give it a thumbs up if you like it. Share this with your friends and subscribe to my channel. I'm a ninja without a name. Don't fall in love.